Well, Colorado is home to hundreds of breweries, making it a uh, beer lover's dream destination, but it's an industry that's been predominantly dominated by white males. Well, that's why Metro State University of Denver and Flying Dog Brewery created a partnership to diversify the profession. Byron Reed has the story. Those are like some of my best memories. Like most children, Colleen Haynes wanted to follow in her father's footsteps. When I started like homebrewing with my dad, I think it is really bonding and it, it was something that led me to what I wanted to do. Haynes is a senior at Metro State University of Denver. We are doing a raspberry pilsner. Studying an art form that's become her passion. This is our brewing science class. She's learning how to craft beer in the school's brewery operations program. Haynes is getting real-world experience preparing for an industry that's trying to attract more women. Like when you think of the typical brewer, you think of like a bearded man. I feel like for some reason that wasn't something that was going to deter me. Haynes is the first in the school to receive a scholarship from their Flying Dog Diversity and Brewing program that provides scholarships to students who are underrepresented in the brewing industry. And you will have different people from different backgrounds and different genders or race, whatever, kind of going in and, and contributing and I think it just makes a better work industry overall. Women were some of the original brewers if you look back, you know, a few hundred years ago, they were doing all the brewing, so it's time to bring it back. Katie Strain is a lecturer and lab manager for the school's brewery operations program. She says the scholarships will help diversify the industry. Our program in particular, we're really trying to recruit people from diverse backgrounds, including women. Um, so having these scholarships available, um, I think will help draw attention, hopefully get more women interested in this industry that I love so much. According to a survey from the Brewers Association, more than 90% of brewery owners identify as white and more than 75% self-identified as male. It's an issue that the school's trying to fix. We have a, definitely a handful of very talented women in the program right now. Um, and I'm seeing more and more in the industry as well. The goal is to expand an industry that's hopping on the bandwagon. But to have different kind of big breweries, not backing you, but supporting you through it, uh, feels really cool. And make room for more students like Colleen, so others can follow in her footsteps. It doesn't matter if you don't fit the typical standard of a job. Like, if you want to do it, you should just go for it. For next. The more, like, diverse it is, the more you're going to be able to reach different people. The scholarship provides financial support to MSU Denver students pursuing a degree in brewery operations. It also guarantees a job with a Flying Dog Brewery after graduation.